Salutations everybody, it is Maddie here today, and as I was surfing the web, I found a really neat article on something that I wanted to highlight. So this information comes from Yargamer.net, and it's titled, Fans Campaign for Skyrim Playing Grandmother to be Immortalized in the Elder Scrolls 6, which may be one of the strangest headlines you'll see this week, but still, it's a very wholesome topic and one that I think people will enjoy partaking in. So let's dive right into it. Now, you may have heard of Shirley Curry. She is an 82-year-old YouTuber who plays a lot of Skyrim. I mean, a lot, a lot, a lot. She does Let's Plays, and like I said, it's just wholesome content. So if you're looking for some feel-good stuff, someone just genuinely enjoying a game and interacting with all of her viewers, this is someone you should absolutely check out. I will have her channel linked in the description down below. I love my grandmother to death. I think she's the coolest person on the planet, but surely makes a good run for something along those lines. Now let's read a bit of this Eurogamer article. Her place at the center of an internet campaign, however, began after a Reddit user spotted her comment on a YouTube video analyzing the comments p made to Eurogamer about the Elder Scrolls 6's release window. I guess that puts the nail in my coffin, Curry wrote. When Skyrim 6 comes out, I'll be 88, so I probably won't get to play it. Evidently, this tugged on the heartstrings of many Skyrim fans, some of whom decided to take action. Reddit user Phantom Scribbler kicked things off with a post calling for Curry to be added to the Elder Scrolls 6 as a follower. As highlighted by Phantom Scribbler, Bethesda has previously done something similar for Oblivion fan Eric West, who visited the studios shortly before passing away from cancer in May 2011. He was subsequently immortalized in Skyrim as Eric the Slayer, and now fans want something similar for Curry. And I've covered in the past another subject for Nuka World, where a fan was immortalized in that game. So Bethesda Game Studios absolutely has a history with these types of things. How cool would it be to come across an elderly Breton who wants to kick some ass and asks to come along with you, Phantom Scribbler explained. She takes up her sword, puts on some armor and says, come on grandson slash daughter, and you're off to tackle whoever gets in your way. Who wouldn't want her as a follower? Apparently, much of the Skyrim subreddit agreed, as the original post received over 9,000 upvotes and even sparked a petition on change.org, which currently has 1,396 signatures at the time of writing. Phantom Scribbler has now added a second post, which calls on the community to help create a Grandma Shirley-themed follower mod for Skyrim. According to the post, Curry is enthusiastically on board with this idea, and Phantom Scribbler has now sourced a modder who is willing to make the follower mod. The team is currently asking for the community's help in choosing dialogue and sounds, however, as it's too much of a task for anyone to sort through all those videos for usable sound bites. If you have a favorite Grandma Shirley line, now is the time to share it. It's so nice to see the community rallying behind something along these lines and getting so much support for it. I mean, it's so well in advance that I don't think it's a huge ask for Bethesda Game Studios at this point in time for them to include something like that, since most likely they're just concepting the game at this point and not many characters have been totally written out, that there's likely room for Shirley to make her way in, especially with this much internet attention for it and we've seen Bethesda Game Studios do it in the past, I simply would not be too surprised if Shirley found her way into the game. But as the community, it's your job to go ahead, share your favorite Grandma Shirley lines, give her all the love and support that you possibly can and try to make this big dream a reality. It'd be something really cool to see once the Elder Scrolls 6 finally comes around. But anyway, that's all I've got for you fine folks today. I hope this was a bit of a nice story to cover and I'll catch you guys next time. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description down below along with my Patreon. Do consider supporting that as it fuels all the content I create here. Stay sexy, stay active. I love you all. Peace.